Masaru was a young samurai from a noble family in the Edo period of Japan. His family's most prized possession was the katana sword that had been passed down for generations. However, one fateful day, the sword was stolen from their home. Masaru was devastated, and his family's honor was at stake. He vowed to retrieve the sword and restore his family's name. Masaru began his journey by seeking out any information he could find about the stolen sword. He visited the markets and tea houses of the city, and after much searching, he finally found a lead. A group of bandits had been seen with a sword matching the description of his family's katana. With determination in his heart, Masaru set out to confront the bandits and retrieve the stolen sword. He traveled through treacherous forests and across dangerous rivers until he finally arrived at the bandits' hideout. Masaru waited until nightfall, and then he crept into the hideout, using all his training to remain silent and undetected. He saw the stolen sword displayed on a stand, and he quickly grabbed it, but the bandits had caught him in the act. A fierce battle ensued, but Masaru was able to use his training and skill to defeat the bandits and make his escape with the stolen sword. He returned the katana sword to his family and restored their honor, becoming a hero in their eyes. From that day on, Masaru became known as a brave and honorable samurai, respected by all who knew him.